What is going on everyone? Welcome back to the channel. And today we're going to talk about how to create a landing page in Go High Level. If you sign up for Go High Level using our affiliate link below, you'll unlock an exclusive extended 30 day free trial. That's double the usual 14 days. Plus we're throwing in over $2,000 worth of bonuses, including this landing page template. So let's go ahead and jump into the video. All right, so our first step in creating a landing page is for us to go to our sub account and go to sites here and go to funnels. Now, uh, we have to make sure that we understand the difference between funnel pages and landing pages because we are going to create our landing pages under the funnels tab. So it's the same, just click create new funnel. You can either start from scratch, um, use the AI builder or or choose anything from uh, the existing templates. All right, so, but again, before we create our uh, landing page or before I show you how to create the landing page, let me first describe um, the funnel pages and how it's different from uh, landing pages. So uh, let's click this. All right, so as you can see, I already have a pre-built funnel page here and it says here it has three steps because uh, normally a uh, funnel page is or a funnel is a series of pages designed towards, um, you know, a certain conversion. It, it guides a uh, user or a customer to a, a certain conversion. Uh, it could be purchase. It could be booking. It, it, it really depends on the goal, right? So as you can see here, I have a uh, homepage or the offer page. And then uh, there's, a, there's the next step. It says sign up and then a thank you page right or for other funnels it could be um, an offer page an upsell page and then a, a checkout page let's say if you're selling a product so that's uh, what a funnel is All right now let's go to a landing page so here when it comes to the landing page it only has a single step so it's just one page so let's click so normally a landing page is just a single page um, just for a specific purpose it could be uh, capturing leads um, or leads lead generation or showcasing an offer or maybe just promoting a service. It's normally used for, uh, let's say, ads, email campaigns, or just to direct traffic. Your landing page can also be part of a funnel, but it can work independently like what I have right here. It only has one page. All right. So of course, if you're going to create a new um, landing page, you just have to click new funnel and you have three different ways in creating a uh, landing page so you can start from scratch you can use ai or you can choose any from the templates so for this tutorial i'll be using our uh, free landing page template that we are offering once you click our affiliate link below well you can see that there are uh, two steps here but it's just uh, a different color scheme it's just the same so essentially this is just a one step or a one page landing page so we'll be editing the uh, landing page template. And my goal for this landing page template is to generate leads and offer uh, a free ebook to uh, potential customers or potential clients that would um, visit the landing page. All right, so let's edit our landing page. So as you can see, this interface is the same interface like how you edit um, or how you build websites. So it's essentially the same. Um, just add elements, add sections, rows. Um, everything is the same. So as again, as for my goal uh, for the call to action or the action that I want to happen is that visitors of the landing page would be able to download a free copy of uh, the ebook that I'm offering. And in return, they have to enter their information for my email marketing campaign or uh, any other digital marketing purposes. All right, so first thing that we need to do is to change the text on the button right here. As you can see, I already changed it to this. Uh, get a uh, free ebook on SMM basics. And I wanna make sure that when you click this, it will open a pop-up. So go to button actions, um, link to open pop-up um, and we want to make sure that we edit the pop-up itself. So go to pop-up settings. 
So as you can see, there's no content yet. So just add row, one column, and then I want to add a form because again, the goal is for me to generate leads or collect um, leads or information. So click, and I already have a pre-built uh, form right here. So I just need the name, email, phone for maybe uh, SMS uh, campaign. Um, and then this button right here, send my free copy of the ebook. Click save and let's view our landing page. All right, so we are now here on the landing page preview and we are going to test our button. So it should pull up a pop-up once you click it. So let's see, and there we go. So the next thing that we need to do is to enter the information here and do a test submission for the form. And for us to do that, we're going to go to the next step, which is to edit and um, configure an automation. So let's go back to our sub account and let's go to automation. So you can definitely uh, create a new workflow. Just click here. Um, but for now, we're going to start from scratch. All right, so here we are now on the uh, workflow editor. So I named this free ebook lead generation. So let's just um, create a very simple automation for our landing page. So add new trigger. So we're working on a form. So next thing that you need to click is form submitted because uh, the action that we're um, trying to uh, create an automation of is a form submission and then add a filter and then click form is and select the form that we're using. So lead generation form and just click save trigger and then let's create an output. So again, um, we want to send an ebook to our uh, visitor. All right, let's look for send email and let's edit this automation starting from here. So it's from our digital marketing agency. I want to use this as the uh, email and this is the uh, subject. And I'm going to uh, choose a template that we already have. And I want to add an attachment, which is the ebook. And you can opt to uh, send a test email, uh, but we're not going to do that for now. All right. And you have to make sure that your workflow is set to publish so it would work. So click save. And we're now going to test our landing page. All right. So we're now here on our uh, preview page. And this is the button that we just edited. Let's click and then let's enter our um, information. And this is what we want to flash when the visitor fills out the form. Okay, so this is our email. So this appeared on our inbox. So this is the, uh, the template that we have. And this is the attachment that we intended to send, which is the uh, free ebook. And one final step to check our um lead if we were able to capture the uh, information that we need to get so let's go back to um, our sub account go to sites and then go to forms and then go to submissions so as you can see this is the latest uh submission that we have and these are the details especially the email and the phone number so these are the things that we need for our email campaign or if we have an SMS marketing campaign. And that is it for this tutorial. We just learned the difference between a funnel and a landing page, and we learned how to create a landing page as well. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and click the notification bell so you don't miss any updates. And don't forget, if you're ready to try out Go High Level, use our affiliate link in the description to unlock an extended 30-day trial, over $2,000 worth of bonuses, and a free landing page template. See you in the next videos.